Okay, so today we got this mystery power box from Walgreens and I have no idea. This thing does not look enticing too much, so I'm going to open it up so that we can have a look in case those of you who have not seen this, I'm going to open it. You're going to get to see. You can judge for yourself whether you want to buy this or not. It does advertise Silver Tempest, Lost Origin, and Brilliant Stars. I like all of them packs, Sword and Shield era, but it also says it has a mystery item. I don't know if you guys can see the mystery item. This is from a third party holder. You can read all that right there if you'd like. But MJ Holding, we've seen these before, but this one doesn't even have like a chase pack or nothing like that. So we're going to get into the thick of it. We're going to figure out what exactly is inside this. So please hit that like button if you enjoy these type of openings. Uh, I need to find my trusty pin. Uh, where, where, where's my trusty pin that? That's already, let's use the Snorlax pin. Take this, and we will cut that plastic seal. Hmm. Okay, oh, that, that plastic's pretty thick. That plastic is pretty thick. Put that back on so we don't poke ourselves. Got that off. Things are rolling. Put that off to the side. All right, let's see what we got here. Um, how does this open? Right here? Right here. All right, so inside here we got, oh, a darkness ablaze. Okay, I haven't opened that in a while. Then we got, an Astral Radiance, okay. It says there's only three packs. But we have a Brilliant Stars and a Silver Tempest. Okay, here's our code card. I had to look inside there real quick because... And it looks like it's a Temporal Forces one pack Carvana. Yeah, so uh, I guess that's the promo for that, but there's nothing else inside there. Um, all right, so let's see once more. Silver Tempest, Brilliant Stars, Astral Radiance. And we have a Sleeved Darkness Ablaze. Hmm. 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 Well, you know what we gotta do? We gotta rip some packs. Uh, we'll hold off on that Darkness Ablaze. Uh, I don't know, Darkness Ablaze does not have that much... Uh, in my opinion, I don't really... There's not many things I like in there. I'm not saying it's a terrible set or anything like that. Or maybe... Maybe maybe it is a terrible set. I don't know. But this is Sword and Shield era, so hopefully we can unpack something cool. And we have Dark Energy. Darkness, Wait and See Turbo, Duop, Jubilife Village, Pursuing Basque, Basculin, Pursuing Voltorb, Glam Meow, Swinub, Chatot, ooh, I, re I ruined the reverse, there's nothing crazy there, no trainer gallery, and uh, Pursuing Arcanine. Alright, so the reason I chose to open this up is because, well, I've gotten lucky with these mystery boxes to the point where like I, I pulled the chase back. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, uh, I'll link the video in the description for you guys to check that out. I, I pulled the chase back. I'm not going to tell you what if you want to figure that out or if you've already seen it, you know what I'm talking about. But if you want to see the chase back I pulled, the link's going to be in the description or you can wait till the end of this video and I'll direct you guys over there. But even in the boxes that I didn't get hits, uh, uh, didn't get the chase pack in, I still got pretty decent hits. Like I, I remember, I think one I pulled the alt art in, and I am doing a long form series of for for mystery boxes. So I'm gonna be opening mystery box. I I like mystery boxes. A lot of people say they're scams. Definitely, I do believe that you can get a better value money wise by just buying like booster boxes or other other products, but. I like the 
I like the the mystery of it all, you know. And then you have obviously there's a chance where you can get a super old pack, but not in these ones, I guess. I mean, it's not even advertised on the box for these ones that you can get anything good, but uh, you can get any chase packs. I mean, but Brilliant Stars is up. I haven't pulled that alt art uh, Charizard or the alt art Ar Arceus. I'm still getting used to calling it Arceus because technically that is the how it's pronounced. I've always been calling it Arceus. To me, that sounds a lot better than Arceus. But I mean, I guess Arceus makes sense, right? Four. All right. Let's see. All right, fist bump energy. Come on. If we can't get an alt art. Hopefully we can at least get a cool trainer gallery. Got that bear tick. Uh-oh. Floatzel. Sock. Corfish. Come on. Okay. Okay. This is Golet. Chimeco. Chimchar. Verse Hollow. Morgrim. Can we at least get nope? Grimstar. Okay. So we are getting skunked on the packs. This is like probably one of the worst. The worst uh, mystery boxes I've ever opened, but Darkness Ablaze, we haven't opened that in a super long time. I do like that it's a sleeved booster pack because typically sleeved booster packs, there's not much chance of tampering on it. And I like to check these now. Nowadays, nowadays, I like to check these because, all right, there's no signs of reseal on this. So uh, it's legit, but Darkness Ablaze, when I used to open this, especially from the Costco packs, like those Costco bundles that, that you can buy, it would give you like a green code card, which meant that you weren't going to get a hit in it, but then it was an error pack and all that stuff. So like, for example, this, I'm supposed to get a hit, right? But we'll see, because Darkness Ablaze is... People, myself included, were getting packs that were misread. Like they were, they would say one, the, it would indicate one thing, but it would be something completely different. And in terms of value, I don't think this set's worth a whole lot. The value is not really a huge deal for me because I, I just like, I like what I like. I collect what I'm interested in. I don't really sell anything. Electrite, Passimian. Okay, Reverse Hollow Grimer. Could this... Last card saved the entire box. I, I don't know. But, oh, okay, it's a hollow Aggron. It looks cool. Cool artwork, right? But it's a it's just a hollow. Um, so, like I said, uh, I have gotten lucky in these mystery boxes before. And if you would like to see that video, click on over here. Other than that, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Peace.